all right we back with the iphone 7 content i know you guys were missing this videos so i am here to talk about it yes i'm late to the party apple will be releasing the rc slash beta 9 of ios 15 really really soon but it's better to cover it as soon as possible before they release like better to be in the party rather than not being in the party late in the party better than not being in the party you know what i'm saying anyways hello everyone how you all doing my name is jay you are watching tech hype let's talk about the iphone 7 on the ios 15 beta 8 and should you consider updating your device to this firmware and i will share my experience using iphone 7 on this firmware for a while if you are new here subscribe to this channel for more iphone 7 related content and uh, let's get right into today's video now all right so first of all you guys probably have already noticed that my iphone 7 display have a little mark that's because one of my brother just spilled water on my device right so just uh, ignore that talking about my experience using iphone 7 on the ios 15 beta 8 the number one thing that i really really hate is the battery life well obviously we can't expect uh, wonders and really really good battery life on a beta software i know that but compared to previous version of beta versions i have realized that beta 8 battery life on the iphone 7 is really really bad also we have some heating issues on the iphone 7 on the beta 8 i will be coming up with that video really soon or maybe that video is already up by the time this video is out so watch out and i will leave a link down in the description below the like button so you can check that out if you are facing any heating issues or battery drain i have talked about it in my recent video talking about performance the beta 8 performance on the iphone 7 is uh, pretty darn okay ish you know what i'm saying uh, it is not something that i am satisfied with to be honest it is okay like it's pretty decent for a beta uh, but at the same time on the beta 6 i remember it was uh, quite a bit better than the beta 8 the beta 7 came out it was worse compared to the beta 6 now the beta 8 is here it is about the same as the beta 7 so i would expect apple to improve the performance on the iphone 7 on upcoming beta or rc as soon as possible because we are just right around the official release this month is it is time right next week is iphone 13 event and we will have the ios 15 rc really really soon then talking about the auto brightness bug well i didn't knew about it but thanks to you guys one of you guys left a comment in my recent video saying that there is a bug on ios 15 beta 8 because i don't use my device is on auto brightness often so that's why i didn't knew about it so there is a bug which just do not update your auto brightness and uh, auto brightness is bugged right now on the beta 8 so i would really really appreciate if apple can fix that as soon as possible also there is a bug where if your storage is suppose my iphone 12 storage is a 64 gb it shows 72 gb on my iphone 7 it also used to say like uh, my 32 gig iphone was 64 gb available like come on what what's up this is really so dumb uh, by the way now on my iphone 7 after doing a hard reset that bug is fixed and i don't think so that bug will bother a lot of people but yes it does exist on the beta 8 and you should be aware about it if you're updating your iphone 7 to this firmware well as you know apple have not really been adding any major or new features to their firmware uh, but also removing actually the share play is gone and uh, i am still waiting for share play to be back and all you know uh, i am really missing it because i tried it and it did work for me earlier on on my iphone 7 it did not work though but on my iphone 12 it did so i would really really want apple to add all those features back as soon as possible there is not a lot to talk about in the beta 8 of iphone 7 after updating my iphone 7 to this firmware there's not a lot to talk about as i have already talked about in my previous videos a bit of a tidbit my iphone 7 in my previous videos so you can check those out if you are interested well that's pretty much it for this video if you did find this video helpful entertaining consider hitting the subscribe button for more videos like these peace out i will meet you all in the very next episode let me know down in comments below that did i not answer your question and if i did not i will make sure to answer that question in the very next episode or you can just dm me on twitter at the rate tech hyped and i will just respond to you guys in like as soon as i can right peace have a great day